Uh huh. And how many? Sure. Oh, I can't go out looking like this. It looks ridiculous. Mm. <gasps> I've got an idea. I saw it on YouTube. Mm. What? Yeah, no, it works. Gaffer tape. Mm. Those will be ready first thing. Bye bye. Alistair, I need six more quiches ready for the morning. Jesus Christ! We're running out of fucking eggs! Start laying your cock. You just stick it on really right. hard. Yeah. Okay, take a deep breath. Right. On the count of three. One! Ah! Ooh. Jesus, Ange! <gasps> Ta da! <laughs> I like that. That looks great. Alright, come on then, let's do the other side. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Oh. Now what am I going to do? Come on guys, we're going to have to start the meeting without her. Hey hon. About bloody time. Yeah, guess who's been covering your shift all afternoon? I don't know, the dead llamas? Sorry, Ange, there was this shit going down at the school and I had to sort it out and then Adelaide Roadworks, you know how that is. Yeah. Now tell me, is it classed as assault if you accidentally drop a sausage roll on a kid? Hot or cold? Clarify the term drop. Technically through. Look, the little shit had it coming. She was giving me... Alright, you can deal with that later. Now come over here. Quickly, come on. This is important. We've had a few customer service complaints so we need to make sure that we're adhering to the guidelines. Now, I've updated our customer service guidelines, which I want us all to adhere. Come on, Penny, she can't keep it bottled up. Oh. Come on, hun, tell us a story. Go on. Oh. All right. So I'm doing my usual volunteer shift at the school canteen. Oh, such a good mum. And this fucking bitch comes up with their stupid friends and their pouty little faces all glued to their phones, which, you know, really gets my grill. Mm -hmm. And she doesn't even look up when she says, get this. Give me sausage roll. <gasps> Would have slapped her right then. I know, but no, I thought Karen, take the high road. Maybe she's got fucked up parents at home, hasn't been taught any manners. Mm -hmm. But then she starts whinging and whining about there being no sauce and said, where's the sauce, you fat bitch? <gasps> And her mate started laughing and oh, I just lost it. So I grabbed the sausage roll and yes, it may have come straight out of the oven. And I squashed it right into a smug little face. What well, you said you threw it. Drop squashed through, what's the diff? About three years. Uh, yeah. And then I grabbed the sauce and I squeezed it all over her fancy hairdo and I said, there's your sauce, you skinny bitch. Oh. I'll put you onto my lawyer, Natalie, if you need it. Oh. Cheers, Dad. Well, with that level of provocation, it should be classed as self-defence. Mm. Yeah, never thought of that. Tell you, teenagers these days, they've got no manners. They deserve a good clip round the ear every now and again. Amen, sister. Yeah. Nah, she's only six. I was at the primary school. <laughs> Little bitch had a mouth and her like a fucking pirate. I might sue for emotional distress. Mm. How much do you reckon I can get for that? <clears throat> Let's start the meeting, shall we? Item one, the customer is always right. Two, treat the customer the same way you would like to be treated. Three, never argue with the customer. be helping out so much in the school canteen anymore. How about giving me a few more hours here? I've actually hired a new staff member and he's starting tomorrow. 